So I'm talking to this brother earlier, and um, he calls me to ask for some information, some projects he's working on, and he thought I would have insight um, into these projects. So we talk about that. I was more than willing and glad to help him out. He had helped me out in the past on so many um, so many things, and I'm very appreciative of that. Uh, but we start talking about mutual people we knew um, in our life from the past, uh, particularly his pastor, who everybody knows that this pastor is very talented, very, um, how can I say, man, very creative. I mean, it just just chock full of 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 real time um um i, I want to look for the right word because i don't want to throw nobody off with this the brother could bring it and i don't mean just bring it in, in an entertaining way he was tremendously or is tremendously deep in his thought so he would take the scripture that you have been hearing forever and bring so much meaning to that scripture that you could see it like you could actually see it talented 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 now a hooper and getting you all excited and all that no nah, none of that i'm talking about real intellect as a matter of fact the same pastor one year they were doing a celebration at the university of chicago and um he was invited to the university of chicago to the rockefeller chapel to um deliver a sermon he was intellectual at the highest level but he is obviously troubled and so he and i um the brother who called me both of us know that and so he was kind of dancing around, you know, kind of how he should say it. Because, you know, he knew I knew it, even though we hadn't talked in years. Um, he knew I knew the same thing. So, you know, I brought it right out there. I said, listen, um, uh, this pastor has helped me out many times. Real deal, supported my business and all of those things. Um, at the same time, I know he's trouble. And obviously, if this brother's pastor, and he was saying, hey, listen, I know the guy is trouble. But he is, he is deep in a way that brings value to your life. And I'm going to tell you, it's not easy for a man to open up to a preacher, pastor in, in that way. So I can know he's troubled, but if he has something to offer, I can hear that too. And so could the brother that I was talking to. So here's my question to you. And Lauren Tillis is on my page. Lauren, if you're looking at this video, you look at Lauren Tillis, man. She, she, she don't like, um, the black pastors. <laughs> so Lauren, if you're on this page, I want your comment on this video. So can a pastor or a leader or a, a visionary or mm, can a called, and I'm using that word calling very loosely, can someone who is called to something that's gifted, that's a good word, gifted to something, can that same person be flawed at the highest level? I say, yeah. As a matter of fact, I think in the Bible it talks about that, um, you know, gifts come without repentance or whatever that, however that works out. I'm, gonna try, I'm not trying to religitize y'all right up in here. I'm just really trying to have a real conversation about people. Our conversation, me and the brother, was about pastors, but look around you. You look at Kanye West. Kanye West is by far, I knew his mother. She was my English teacher at Chicago State. Um, just a superior mind. But he's troubled. No doubt about that. Um, just look at, just look, I mean, name a man. I mean, what, what, how, who, I, he, left eye that passed away. God rest his soul. Um, um, uh, Donald Trump, you know, obviously he's not a dummy, what some people consider him to be. Um, Joe Biden, even though he's half sleep all they now, you know, you know, he has something to offer. Can a person be troubled at a deep level and still be gifted to the point where you'll give yourself to them at least for what you need to get from them? Can they be called to give something to the people and be heavily troubled at the very same time? Just go back. Think of entertainers, um, athletes, artists, um, preachers, singers. Name some of the people that have the greatest gifting to be able to be of benefit to you, whether it's teaching you, educating you, um, giving you information. But at the same time, they can be troubled at a very high level. Prince, gifted, troubled. Michael Jackson, gifted, troubled. Whitney Houston, 
gifted trouble. In every echelon from scientists to mathematicians to politicians, to every echelon, you see this. So my question and what I'm asking, does a very troubled person who is gifted have value? And think about this too. We only know the public people that we see and that's on TV and everything else. But what about the people that are not in the public eye? I'm sure many of you are working for uh, corporations who have a CEO who is gifted, no doubt, because you have a job. So they built something. But at the same time, could be highly troubled and you never know that. You don't even ask the question. So I'm asking you, in a conscious way, do we, can we, should we give ourselves over? I'm not saying forever. I mean, I'm not saying you join a person's church who um, is troubled and you know it. You know, in my view, I would never join and stay at a, a person's church that's troubled. But that doesn't mean I won't sit down with that person and feed off this person's table if they have a gifting um, and a a gifting towards um, discerning things and whatever. Come on. That don't mean that for me. I'm just talking about me. Well, what about you? Will you give yourself over for a little while to understand, to have a conversation, to get some insight from a troubled person who is gifted at the same time? Is that hypocrisy? Is that a contradiction? I want to hear from the pastors. I want to hear from the preachers. I want to hear from, I want to hear from you. Because not only are we talking about pastors and preachers here, but we have people in every echelon of society that we're functioning with, accountants. Your accountant may be able to add unbelievably mathematician out this world, but they could be a crackhead and functional at it. Would you give yourself over to them? Because though they're gifted, they're troubled. That's my question. Answer it. Thank you for hanging out with me. I'll be back with another one.